Hi everybody, I'm Lon McCarran along with Norm and Chad and together we've been broadcasting the World Series of Poker since 2003 and today we're here to introduce you to our brand new home. We've been to Binion's on Fremont Street, we've been to the Rio and now on the Las Vegas Strip finally and if you're here for the virtual press conference, welcome. Introducing you to Bally's future known as Horseshoe and Paris. It's gonna be a great beginning. Yeah, we're gonna introduce you to where you're gonna game now, where you're gonna dine now, where you're gonna park now, and where you're gonna have fun now in the city that never sleeps, or is that is that New York? I don't, New York care, no. I don't care if it's New York. New York, screw New York, they're 24-7. Here in Las Vegas, we're 25-7. So sit back, relax, and enjoy a tour of the new home of the World Series of Poker. If you have never played a World Series of Poker event and you're coming this year, welcome to the family. This needs to be your initial stop, really. Right off the escalators from the parking garage is the WSOP Caesars Rewards Desk, where you can pick up for free your Caesars Reward card. Very important to have one. Yeah, and if you lose your card, this is where you come to get another card at the Caesar Rewards Desk. Or if you forget your card, I got about 30 of these babies at home in my nightstand, you come here. Uh, one personal note, uh, Lon and I like to play mm -hmm. Reward Card Roulette, where that makes the decision on which one of us is gonna pay for our entry fees. I lose again. And I know from personal experience, you never need to cash in a World Series of Poker event to keep your Caesars Rewards card. We are standing in front of the Champagne Ballroom. So don't forget that name, very important. It will be your first stop when you get onto property. This is where all the cages are. Increased capacity, 16 this year, Norman. Also, 10 VIP windows. That's not for Lana and I, we're no. just IPs. VIPs like Helmuth, Negrano, and the other poobahs of the poker world. <laughs> so yeah, this is where you wanna come register. Also, if you've won a seat on WSOP.com, you come here to verify the seat. And lastly, if you made a deposit onto your account, come here, verify the funds. They say, okay, you're good to go. Then you can use the kiosk throughout the property to register for tournaments. Okay, a couple of things of note, even though it is the champagne ballroom, it is bring your own champagne. All right. Also, just in case the lines get too long, and they shouldn't, we, we have very fast and friendly attendance. I will be about 15 feet to the right, and I can take your cash payments for <laughs> entries, uh, and I'll get your seats up to your hotel room a little later. Well, right now we are on the threshold of the Paris Ballroom. 88,000 square feet, it will be home to over 300 poker tables. 88,000 square yeah. feet, that is larger than Phil Helmuth's ego. <laughs> right behind me, all the satellites, all the deep stacks, all the live action, including the high roller live action at King's Lounge with 14 tables. And if you're buying into an event that is less than $10,000, this will be your home on day one. Yeah, this will be my home. Most of the time, I only play day <laughs> ones. If your player receipt says Bally's Grand Ballroom, well, this is your place. Look for Platinum, go through these doors, and you are ready to play. You've got 187 tables. 187 tables? I'll tell you why it's 187, because 187 is a prime number. No, it's not. Okay, whatever. 187 tables. This is for the day two under 10K events. Also, some overflow events for the larger fields can take place in here. And also, for those of you who like to re-enter, and I know a lot of you mm -hmm. like to re-enter, the re-entry cage is right here. To make it really easy for you, you don't have to go all the way over there. <laughs> right here, you re-enter right inside here. Adjacent to Bally's Grand Ballroom is Bally's Event Center, where Norman and I are standing right now. Get it in your mind, that's where you wanna play. 87 tables, including five feature tables where the final tables will be played and the new home of the mothership. Yeah, this is where all the greats have become great. No, no, they it's haven't. Johnny Moss, Texas Dolly back-to-back, -back, Stu Unger back-to-back, -back, Johnny Chan. first year here. Okay, well this is where the future greats will plant their flag as World Series of Poker icons. That's where most of the world champion banners are held as well, give you inspiration to make it through that final push, win the final table, and become a champion. With the move to the new Las Vegas property, there were a lot of concerns about what the parking situation would be, but we're happy to report that between Bally's and Paris, there are nearly 8,000 spots available, which is almost double what we had at the Rio. And if you like to gamble, like I do, mm -hmm. perhaps you have a certain Caesars reward status. 
Seven stars, diamond and platinum level gets you parking for free. In addition to that, if you're not quite the gambler Norman is, you can get a Caesars Reward credit card and that will get you free parking as well. If you don't have it, you can register for one here and get your card within 24 hours. I'm gonna tell you the great thing about this card, Lon pays a $75 annual fee just to spend time with me. This card, no <laughs> annual fee. Much better deal also. Here are some of your other parking options. All right, you guys ready? All right, we're ready. Okay. Norman. What? Norman, what are you doing? What are you talking about? Uh, Norman, I think that's enough. Thank you. Wow. De Suisse, au casino, a complex de Paris, Las Vegas. Un regard, un baguette. 20 years I've put up with this. Sorry, folks. Uh, let's move on right now. Just steps away from the poker tables. Got some great places to eat here at our new venue. Well, you play poker, you got to eat. They kind of go hand in hand. And one of the great things about the move here to the Strip is a number of fine places to eat at both Paris and Bally's. And we're gonna start with the WSOP Cafe, which you're all familiar with from the Rio. Well, we've got two here, one at Paris, one at Bally's. You know, all the fine food, all the options just steps away from the table. All right, we all know about the WSOP Cafe. Let's, let's talk about the places you wanna go when you have a quick break, the places you wanna go when you've taken a bad beat, the places you wanna go when you wanna celebrate. So many options. Now, if you're on a break from the poker tables, maybe check out these establishments. You got the food court at Bally's that has Sbarro, Johnny Rockets, Subway, and other good food. And there's the Nosh Deli. Great name. Nosh Deli is located right next to the Bally's poker room. There is Cafe Bell just off the Paris casino floor for all your coffee needs, plus pre-made sandwiches and salads. All right, so you've taken a bad beat. It's time to eat your feelings. Check out these spots. We're talking Bobby's Burgers, next level burgers at Paris. And if you mention my name, Bobby Flay will probably not personally cook your burger. <laughs> and check out Giordano's Pizza in the Grand Bazaar shops at Bally's. Chicago style pizza, deep dish, gotta love it. And they've also got some that are pre-made. You can just pick up at the window and go. Also in the Grand Bazaar shops, Dave's Hot Chicken. If you're looking for really spicy and hot, uh, they're pretty flexible, though. If you want it mild, they'll give it to you mild. Well, you've made your first cash, maybe your first final table, or maybe the unthinkable you've won your first World Series of Poker bracelet, and it's time to celebrate. There is Nobu Paris. Chef Nobu. Yeah, that Nobu. <laughs> for just the best sushi and small plates you can ever find. And the restaurant man who needs no introduction, Gordon Ramsay. Steak, great steaks, beautifully prepared. And if you play your cards right here on the right night, maybe Gordon will come over and yell at you during dinner. And celebrate in luxury at Vanderpump à Paris. Incredible cocktail garden, elevated eats, and no chance of seeing me. They won't let me in. We're very excited to be here on the property, Paris Valleys on the Las Vegas Strip. Really happy you could join us for this tour, and we hope you have a very successful World Series of Poker. Don't bother me if I'm playing a hand.